What's up, Internet? My name is Attack Slugger. Welcome to the Cold Boot, where I look at new games and or DLC. And today, looking at the Fatal Frame Maiden of the Blackwater trial version for the Wii U, aka Fatal Frame 5. And because of what I've heard this game does with the Wii U gamepad, I have a second camera. Hi there. Uh, to show you what the gamepad functionality is going to look like, etc, etc. So hopefully uh, this is going to go well, I don't actually know. It's the middle of the day, I, I apologize, it's supposed to be a scary game, it's the middle of the day, and I'm sitting here at like, it's like 2 o'clock. But, I'm going to hit A here, and we're going to get started. And I got on my headphones, because it's, you know, a scary game. Uh, this demo, I think, does the first two chapters, I don't know how long this video is going to be. But I'm going to play as much as I can, uh, in the time that I have, to record this stuff. So, set the brightness so you can see the ghost's face at the end. Oh, I... Okay, yeah. I usually leave my brightness stuff on default uh, for most games that I play, but I can understand why you would want it for atmosphere. This game is a work of fiction! Uh, but actually, it's based on a real place uh, known as the Suicide Forest in Japan. So... Here we are in the prologue, lurking in the deep. Now, the Fatal Frame series, for those of you who don't know, uh, there were three games that came out in English, the uh, officially, which were PS2 games, if I recall correctly, and then ported to Xbox, spirited away. And then the fourth game came out in Japan on the Wii, and that never got localized officially. It came out, uh, there was a patch for it that you could do uh, to localize it. And then they remade the second game on the Wii. I think that came out in Europe. And then, obviously, this game is the most recent. And from what I hear, it's not that good, so it might be the last. And again, it's a Wii U game. This game is digital only in America. In Europe and Japan, there is a disc version. But in America, it is digital only. And I think it's 50 bucks? I'm not actually sure. But in any event, there's no disc version. And... The Wii U is not region free, so that fucking sucks. So you better fucking love this series if you're going to spend that much money on a game that you can't trade in somewhere. It's how I feel about it. Anyway, we're all wet here. We are all effing wet, and it is cold. So let us see how the game... Let me turn up my little uh, headphones here. I can get a good sense of the horror. The horrors. I can get a good sense of it in my headphones, because... Normally, I don't bother with headphones, but... I'm vibrating here, it's not... That's not good. So, I'm not in control yet, just to let you know. I'm not actually... You can see my, my thumbs here, not doing anything, but... Something is coming. It's Christmas. Christmas is coming. Oh, I don't like that at all. That's... I'm in the game now, really? How about we just get the fuck out of here? Let me go. Yeah, I have to get out of here. Uh, frame rate not so great immediately. I can, I can tell that much. Oh, hi. That's... Do I hit buttons here, or it's not really clear on what I should be doing? Oh, there we go. Uh, let's just walk around, you motherfuckers. Oh, hi. Nope. Let's just... Ma'am, your cleavage is exposed. You might want to... I, I understand you're a ghost, but still. Show a little bit of modesty there. Head toward the open door. Magically, magically closing door. Uh, saving. So this game does, uh, from what I understand, you know, you can play through the entire demo or the trial version, and then that keeps your save file when you want to buy the full version. You don't, you don't have to start over, which is always good. All right, I'm underground. So how long before before we get our spirit camera? So the thing with the Fatal Frame series is that there's usually a camera that you use to spot the ghosts and to escape the ghosts. This is one of those games where you can't actually fight, really. You, you can't, there, you know, there, there's no ZL. There's no combat stuff. You're just trying to escape, much like a Clock Tower series 
uh, style of game. That's all like live action, looks like. Yep. Maybe. I don't know. That's definitely CGI, but Fountains of Blood, definitely not what I want to be dealing with. So... Z... Mm hmm Okay, yes, it is... Like... I understand how to use the game pad controls. I'm not an idiot. A little bit of screen tearing going on here. Uh, I can't tell if it's screen tearing or if it's, if it's an intentional uh, effect on the game. Oh, well, the game's called Maiden, Maiden of the Black Water, so I think we have met our titular character, the Maiden of the Black Water, and we need to go. We need to go. We we need to go. Not this way. Oh, this. This is very disorienting. Uh. This is very. Nope. I'm gonna die in the prologue, because I'm fucking stuck. Nope, okay. Yeah, no. Stop saying that. Let's hug this corner here and go this way. There we go. We were just here! Cutscene. Well, that's not unsettling or anything. There's your black water. Might want to look into that. Might want to call a plumber. Oh, hi. Y'all done fucked up, you know that, right? You fucked up. Yep, it's just encapsulating her completely, and uh, she is... Give me a hug! So that was our prologue? I don't know. Are we gonna find, like, our, our, our actual main character? Oh, frame rate. what are you doing? It shouldn't be that choppy there. Wow, that's a real... that's... that's a damn shame. Look at that. That's like that's like that's like going like 15 for a second there. That was All right. The mountain. That mountain. All right. Three protagonists. Who we got? Yuri, Ren, and Miyu. Fate of Frame, late title card. Maiden of Blackwater. I'm, I'm sorry, it's Maiden of Blackwater, not Maiden of the Blackwater. That's, you know, a different thing, I guess. So, more cutscenes? Or are we gonna just, you know, actually get into some... First drop of Vanishing Trace. Shadow Reading. Psychometry. All right. When do we get our camera? Now see that? 
having having a low frame rate here is intentional because it's a, you know supposed to be an old film. Like it's got the the film grain. That makes sense that it's got a you know a shit frame rate here. But before that shouldn't have had a shit frame rate. You've got so much to live for. Don't don't jump. That seems pretty dangerous. Like some wind could really just fucking kill you there. Yeah, me too. Man, I am alone. I will end it all. Alone. Yuri? Hmm? Stop daydreaming. Put some fucking pants on, Jesus. There we go, here we go. The camera. I should also mention there is a spin-off game on the 3DS uh, called Spirit Camera. On the gamepad. On the gamepad. This is your opportunity. First case. I'm sure you'll be don't bet on it. Let's start with a little practice. Okay. It works exactly like a normal camera. Give it a try. Just hold up the camera. Press X to enter photo mode. Okay, now we kind of move it. Up. Oh, hi! Aren't you pretty? I'm gonna step over here. Oh, yeah, this is so... It's, having this other camera here is a, is a good idea for this video. Uh, that's good. The camera obscure photographs the netherworld. So you're saying that you're a demon. I'm photographing you right now. Demon. Alright, uh... Alright, move down. Photograph both circles. That? Am I really just taking pictures of her boobs? Like, is that really what's happening here? Is there a third circle? Wait, what? Oh, vertically. Duh. Okay. Uh, so, like that, and then, what button is it? Is the L? Well, that's not a great picture, but... Alright, hold down to ZL to lock on targets. Press CR. Exit photo mode, press X. Got it. Take this. I'm learning things. Okay. Touch the touchpad to... There we go. Okay, now I got a map. Search inside the advanced... So... Right stick to walk around, left stick to look around. Just flashlight, no pants on. Like, you're going to this fucking abandoned ass house and you're not wearing pants. That seems. That seems like you're gonna get tetanus, is what that seems like. Come on now. Urban exploring means you fucking need pants on, not a short skirt. God damn it, Japan. So, we got a thing here that's kind of saying where we should go, I guess. Uh, it seems to be pointing in... I could have swore that was like a... Wow. Oh, oh, there's something, something to check there. Plants, okay. Phenomenal. Right, isn't there a... There we go. Run is not very effective. Holy shit. Is she wearing, like, spats? Is that what she's wearing? It's, I don't know. This this seems to be very similar to the area I was just in when I died, so... Same house, but years later, is my speculation. Oh, hi, ghost. What up, Casper? What up, Slimer?
Uh... Don't worry, I have a camera. And all of a sudden, it's fucking like the. T I can sense Hold ZR to find the trail. It's called a trace, a shadow of the past. The token is showing you the way. All right then. These traces can lead to the right path. I just keep holding the button and keep That's following the. Shadow. Yep. Follow the trace. Got it. I can't run though when I'm doing that, which is uh, unfortunate. But it's a straight hallway, so that's okay. Right, he's going that way. But there's something over there, so of course I'm gonna go pick pick pick, uh, pick that up. Collectibles. What is this? Hold down ZR. Pick up items. What do we got here? That book is in way too good condition for sitting in an abandoned ass hallway. Okay, we're not going to read all this, but we got some backstory here. Suicide spot! Yep, that's the plot of the game. Alright, so going that way. That was a ghost. That was straight up a ghost. So, if we hold X like this, and then we activate our thing. No? Is that not gonna... Hmm. No. Could've sworn. Well... Going that way. Okay, yeah, but what's over here? Hoping to doubt. Very, very. Anybody? Bueller? Oh, that looks creepy. That looks creepy. A picture of that. I guess it wants us to go. Uh, no side stuff. Just keep heading toward the main objective. Us, I suppose. So I guess we'll see. Like I said, you should have been wearing pants. You're gonna get tetanus. You're gonna get uh, an infection by not having anything on your legs. It seems like poor planning. Honestly, this 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 this, this whole outfit with the exposed shoulders is poor planning. You're you're in an abandoned fucking. Desolate area. Doors locked. Try using the camera obscura. This is like Pokemon Snap, but with ghosts. Psychic photograph. Yeah, no shit. I was just there. See. I've played so many video games in my lifetime that video games are just kind of ingrained into my... This is how things work in video games. And certainly... Oh, that's... That's somebody's feet. Holy shit. Okay. I, did you, I fucking saw that. That's somebody's feet. But I, 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 I turn around and it'll fucking be, be, be gone. It was right... It was feet, like right there. And, and now it's not there. Damn you, camera, you're failing me! Okay. Let's... Like, I was just here. Stop being so damn careful. So, there we go. On to... Pick it up. Don't be shy. Key on the red keychain. Updating the map. No, I... 
Wow, this game really... This game... Oh, hi, yeah. Hello. I got your picture. This game is really just uh, heavy-handed in its tutorial approach. And considering, like, certainly it is, you know, the first f f Fatal Frame on the Wii U. But it's also, like, the fifth Fatal Frame game. So, if you're buying a digital-only Fatal Frame game, you've probably played the other ones and you know how this shit works. I would hope. Or at least how video games work. It's like, hey, I was just here, got the key, go back, use the key. Like, it's not that hard. Like, I'm not five. Come on now. Anyway. Take a look around. Uh, Try searching with the camera too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try. Invisible. Yep. Got it. Bringing it back. Come back to the world. Wait, what? Why isn't it working? Tilt? I got it. Yeah. ZR. Do I keep doing it? Or like... No. Hold ZL. Tilt the... It's right there. This is something else. It's right there. Hold ZL. Tilt... Oh, I see. I see. You gotta be specifically... I get it. You gotta actually tilt, tilt like that. It's a spooky book! I'm not sure I would handle a book that was not currently in existence that calmly. That's just me, though. Good job. No shit. Let me guess, there's gonna be ghosts. Well, at least they had the common sense to come here in the daytime. That's, you know, tantamount for most experiences in scary-ass... Uh, things is to get the fuck out and certainly don't visit at night like an idiot. Like, Until Dawn, just for example, Until Dawn. I love that game. That game's fantastic. However, Until Dawn, oh, I saw a ghost. It's right there. It's right there. Close the door. Uh, those kids went up to that cabin in a snowstorm at night. That's fucking stupid. Well, I can't hear you. You can't tell me what to do. Let me guess, that's gonna happen. Repeatedly, over the course of this game. I saw something over here. Game's pretty good about having things just out of frame that, you, that you're gonna see. And kind of like, that's a ghost. It's a goddamn ghost. The lighting in the cutscenes is so much different than the actual game engine, it's kind of jarring. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, hi. Like I said, should have worn pants. Gotcha, bitch. Nice. Nice! Here's the combat. Well, combat, quote-unquote. ZR! ZR! Yeah! My camera gun! 
Fighting ghosts. Keep on hitting it, I guess. Die! Oh. There he is. Targets. It seems like a lot. You just only get two. I don't know. Two. Did I do it? Oh! No, I didn't do it. Fatal time. Ghost. Gonna banish his ghost. What's up? How you like that? There you go. What's up? What you got? What's up? Well, now your camera's all wet, so... It sucks. Shouldn't we be, like, leaving? Alright, I think that is a good place to stop here in Fatal Frame, Maiden of Black Water for the Wii U. I think there's another chapter here that's playable in this trial. I could be wrong, but uh, this is probably a good spot to wrap it up. Uh, I think there's uh, like another little uh, chapter title here. I don't actually know, but you know, you've gotten a good taste of what this game is. I've heard it's not great, uh, but you know, perhaps there'll be a sale at some point. Anyway, this is the cold boot. I am your host, Attacks Like This is Fatal Frame, made into black water for the Wii U. Out now, digital only, and I will see you next time right here on this channel. And I'm out.